Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm filming another swatch party video. You guys know I got palettes coming out of my and so I wanted to knock one of these out because I'm sure you guys are dying to see swatches of the new Juvia's Place Festival palette. Now this was announced I believe sometime last year and I thought for some reason that it was going to come out around the holidays because it's called a festival palette. But they actually end up releasing that one called the Doce palette, which is like the pretty pink one. I'll throw up a picture in case you guys have no idea what I'm talking about. But this last week, they did like a pre-sale for the festival palette, which looks like this. And then the official launch date of this is February 15th. So I was, you know, stalking the Juvia's Place Instagram page like a hawk because I knew they were going to do a pre-launch and so I was able to grab it. So without further blabbering, let's get into some swatches. Okay guys, so I am so excited for these two red eyeshadows. Oh my god. And then this white color. So freaking pretty. So these are the first three shadows. I'm just going to go three at a time. So the first shade is called Izafa. And then we have Uli. Oops, I just accidentally skipped it. And then I have um, Uli and then of Ofala. I'm going to put the names down. Sorry. So this is the middle white shade. I just accidentally flip-flop these around because I'm so freaking excited. This shade Ofala looks more orange it's more like a hot orange color but i'm still really pumped it's hard to find red eyeshadows that aren't a pressed pigment because i know a lot of people try to use try to make it cruelty free i don't think this palette is going to be cruelty free it doesn't say that it's cruel oh it does say it's cruelty free interesting hmm I'm not sure, so the box says it is, but on the back here too, I should read this to you, it says, The festival, a gathering of ritual celebrations filled with bold, daring, and mystical trances. A fetish party complemented by exuberant colors. The festival eyeshadow palette consists of nine highly pigmented eyeshadows, and it says it's a cruelty-free product distributed by Juvia's Place, New Jersey, designed and formulated in the U.S. and manufactured in the People's Republic of China. This is what the box looks like as well. Juvia's Place palettes are pretty well known for being absolutely vibrant. They've been doing a lot of like palette, nine pan palettes like this, which I really appreciate because honestly, who's ever going to get through all the powder shadows they own, at least people that I know. So this is the third row. It's all matte. I honestly appreciate the three colors that they chose for the third row. I've been loving pinks in my crease. I love this salmon shade they chose and Oro is a beautiful mustard so I hope when I blend that out in my crease it'll actually show up as a mustard and not turn into a brown shade. It's not super pigmented but hopefully you guys can see it. And also guys if you want to check out my swatches more just pause the video because it'll freeze the frame and then you'll be able to take a closer look at the shadows if you guys want to you know if I'm going too fast or something or you want to check something out a little bit closer I would just recommend pausing and taking a look okay so first six swatches done I'm going to swatch the other ones on my other hand so there's a beautiful like blackened shimmer shade and then a beautiful teal shade and a beautiful gold shade so here are the last three oof so I'm going to start with this little pinky teal gold. Wow. Sorry, I got some of the gold in the wrong spot. But oh my god, those are so beautiful. How stunning. Honestly. So, so pretty. So let me show you all the shades together. It'll be interesting to see what kind of looks people come up with this palette. I think you're going to see a lot of really beautiful, vibrant sunset eyes. Um, I feel like that's what I'm leaning towards the most with this palette is just a lot of really beautiful, like, sunset eye looks. But take a nice, close look at these. They are gorgeous. Let me know if you guys have any questions on the palette. Otherwise, I believe it will be on sale on February 15th on JuviusPlace.com. I will leave the link down in the description box if you are watching this at a later time and the palette is available and you would like to shop. 
Okay guys, that is it for my Juvia's Place The Festival Palette Swatch Party. If you want to see any other swatch videos, I actually have a swatch playlist. So I will go ahead and link it up in the cards for you guys. Every palette I swatch goes to my swatch playlist. So that's a really fun way for you guys to check out some of my older videos. I've definitely swatched a lot of Juvia's Place palettes in the past. I actually own all the Juvia's Place eyeshadow palettes because I hashtag can't stop, won't stop with the Juvia's Place lineup. But yeah, thank you guys for watching and I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Bye.